Howdy everybody, I'm Francis, this is Kyle Evo Gaming, and I'm once again back with Final Fantasy VII. I do not have the camera on, the face cam, because my hair looks really stupid right now. And I just, I mean, it's, I'm, it's in a specific way just because I'm trying to get it ready to do something very specific with my hair. And while a lot of people says, it looks fun, oh, it looks cool. I just think it makes me look stupid. So, uh, yeah, no. I guess I could wear a hat, but I just don't want to. Um, so again, kind of by accident, I moved on a little bit uh, in here. But I did save a bit before I moved forward. I just couldn't remember which file. I think this is the file uh, before kind of the big cutscene. Um... I did do a little bit of the cutscene uh, where Sang, you run into Sang, and you see how he got hurt by Sephiroth, you know, him doing his crazy psycho babble as usual about uh, planet something, meteor something. But uh, here's kind of the big cutscene uh, where I did not save over, so I'm going to do as I did before where I'm going to play through everything again and the boss battle and that whole scene and then cut and go back to where I had left off before. So again, I apologize. Um, so here we go.
Sorry to interrupt, but <clears throat> I think one of my favorite things that are completely underused, but at the same time, it's probably best that's underused because it would lose its charm, is Nanaki doing that, standing up on like his back legs, kind of, and crossing his arms, because I don't, I've, I don't think I've ever had anyone else in my party of. However many times I've been in this temple, because you have to have Eris, and I, I'm pretty certain I've always had Nanaki, and I don't know how anyone else would react by standing, standing there, but I feel like Nanaki is like almost giving you this look, or maybe the player this look, I'm probably thinking way too much into it. But it's like, he even has like this, this look like, bitch, are you serious? We all just saw the same thing, right? Like, he's clearly, clearly Cloud stripping. Something's wrong with Cloud. He's about to do something crazy, Eris. Something's wrong with Cloud. We should probably, we should probably put Cloud somewhere else because he's about to do something crazy. Or is that just me? I mean, look at him. Look at that face. Look at the way he's standing. That's why, like, I almost wish I would have brought somebody else just to see how they would react. Because I don't know if everybody else would have that same look. Because we all know that Nanaki has the same kind of always oh, connected to the earth and, you know, all that kind of thing. Ah, the con, chill out. Um, but I'm wondering if it's, if Nanaki has that same sort of suspicion. <laughs> uh as well and Eris is just kind of like too nice to kind of be like you know hey cloud i think something's wrong <laughs> i don't i don't know if you're aware but you're kind of having like this weird seizure laughing at the wall laughing at the meteor falling and i i don't know but like i just i mean look at him you just i don't know i'm probably thinking way too much into it but it was just like the last like two times i played through it i'm like Nanaki seriously has like this face like I feel like he should be like looking at the camera like you all just saw that right like something's wrong with Cloud like some something real's about to happen here I'm just saying we don't trust Cloud right now okay just make sure you all saw that okay I don't know anyway I'll be quiet now Gosh, Anaki's cute. <laughs> and there's Bahumi. Um, so, oh, right. 
Uh, so also, what I did l when I was playing through it, um, I went through every single room, you know, in that clock room, and then I also fell down to the bottom clock room, uh, just letting the clock knock you off and you fall into the pit. That's where you get Cloud's uh, nail bat. It doesn't have any materia slots, but it's like really strong. Uh, I'm not gonna do that this time though, just cause, you know, I already did it and I don't wanna do it again. Uh, but yeah, just throwing that out there. So if you're wondering, oh no, there's some pretty sweet items. Don't leave those items. I already got those items. <clears throat> Let's shake it! There's that adorable little pose again. Ah, it's so cute. <laughs> yes, lots of different flunkies, Cloud. Again, I'm telling you, their reception is amazing. Cause right now they're they're not even like they're in some other spiritual worldly place, right? They still get reception. How are they getting reception? I just don't understand. And also, I don't understand how he they could hear the whole story as well. But you know, minor details. <clears throat> yeah, sure. So another thing to note that I didn't know, so I had to actually restart again. Once you go to that room, uh, and that whole cutscene takes place, this just forces you to go right to the boss. Howdy. Um, so if you like wanted to go to all the rooms, it's best to not enter that room. So after you enter that room where the cutscene happens, you have to go straight to the boss. You can like do the whole little puzzle thing and come back out and then go to all the rooms then fall down into the pit and get the nail bat, but don't don't enter the room if you want to go to all the rest of the rooms and get the stuff. I don't remember all which times have the items, but I don't know. I go to all the rooms. I, I don't look it up. I just go to all of them. It doesn't, I don't know. Like I said, I'm not in a hurry, so it doesn't matter.
You know, I keep forgetting to do this and I did it again. I don't have Nanaki's final limit break set. Oh, Cloud's dead. Sorry, Cloud. Um, <laughs> I forgot to set Nanaki's final limit break. And I, even though I like had to reset it at one point. Oh, he's dead. Uh, I forgot to reset it again. Yeah, it is kind of a freaky enemy. It's just a big giant wall with a face on it. Forget T4! I would have loved to have been wedded by a stuffed cat with a microphone on top of a giant Mog plushy. That would have been a great, great wedding, right? Right, love? Oh, and the only reason I don't have the camera on is because, you know, my hair looks really stupid. The camera works fine. I specifically turned it off. It's not cute. It looks stupid.
cute little kid. Look at me, I'm adorable. I wonder if I have a stupid oak face as a kid. I probably do. Maybe I don't. Sorry. I love that Nanaki's running back and forward like an anxious dog just barking at the wall. <laughs> you, you keep doing you, Nanaki. I'm proud of you. Nanaki's a good boy. And and now I guess he's tried trying trying to a attack <laughs> Cloud? Can I still move around? Oh I can still move around as a little cloud. I don't think I ever noticed that. Look at me go. I can't do anything else as a little cloud though. Yeah, you you uh keep giving yourself that beating man, cause you really messed up there. I am extremely disappointed in you, sir. And I like that Eris is just laying there, kind of blinking on the ground, like, Oh, God. I so bet on the wrong horse. <laughs> and Kate's just like, Oops, looks like a bad time. <laughs> oh, you gotta pretend he has a uh, Scottish accent. Uh, but I can't do that. Good job, Nanaki. He just kind of like slapped him. I see you, Eris. Hi, girl. It's a spooky forest. Full of spooky women that can teleport from tree to tree. Ah, I love you, Eris. Too bad, like, Cloud doesn't listen. Like, you gotta wonder if, like, if Cloud didn't go after Eris and, like, he actually let Eris do what she was intending on doing, would this have happened? You know, would she be dead? I don't know. Or, like, was, was Sephiroth just kind of waiting there for Cloud? I just, I just wonder. I don't know. It's all these, like, wonders like why didn't cloud listen to her if anything it's kind of it's a little disrespectful don't you think she's like cloud you're a little bit of a you, you got you got a lot going on in your head you need to take your time figure your yourself out um mama eris got this uh cuz you're a little you got a little too much baggage <laughs> so Go lay down. Just go take a nap. I got this right now. You know?
Yeah, just kind of go... Just lay him down in a room. Sedate him or something. And let everyone else kind of do it. Like, he didn't have to... Didn't have to do all this stuff. Like, yes, he could do some stuff, but... I don't know, just let Eris do... Her thing. Exactly. Like, he... If anything, like, if Cloud wouldn't have gone, Sephiroth probably wouldn't have been there. So... I guess it is... It probably is, you know, maybe Cloud's fault? Like... Sephiroth can, like, smell Cloud? And he's like, ah, Cloud is there. So, like, he just kind of follows Cloud, because he just, like, has, I don't know, that weird gay Cloud connection thing. <laughs> so he was able to find Eris. Whereas if he would have just left Eris alone, probably would have never found her. And then we'd be summoning Holy or whatever by now. Oh, bye, Eris. I love you. Yeah, now we're just being hard on Cloud. <laughs> he said he's a clone dude with a sword. He is just a clone dude with a sword. See, now if Zack was here, Zack would have listened to Eris. Because Eris would have been like, Zack, please go. And he would have been like, all right, sweetheart, you gotcha. I, don't, I just winked. I did wink and did the finger guns at the camera, but the camera's not on. So pretend that you saw me do the wink and the finger guns at the camera. I mean, he just, he did just say that Sephiroth already knows where she is. So I don't know, he was probably just hanging around literally waiting for Cloud to get there just to be a dick. So, it's kind of hard to tell. I don't know. It's really hard to tell with Sephiroth. It's like, is he a dick or is he socially awkward? I don't know. Maybe a little bit of both. But it's probably not good to have Cloud. Like, if this would probably be a good opportunity to not have Cloud in your party. Like, why not ha send every er anybody else but Cloud? Or, why doesn't Tifa tell Cloud, Hey, by the way, you're not soldier first class. Um, you're actually just kind of a loser. You know? That that probably help a few things, few few like a ravel a few things, and maybe he could start piecing some stuff together, get his life together. And while they're figuring out his life, you know, Sid and Vince and Barrett and Anaki, you know, all the capable people, pretty much everybody but Tifa who doesn't do anything, and maybe the stuffed toy, <laughs> they can sit here and I don't know sit. And then everyone else can go help, you know? I don't think Cloud is the ring. Because they, they already said that... Uh, Cloud already said that Sephiroth knows where Eris is. But it's, it's like... It's not good to have Sephiroth and Cloud in the same room, I guess.
Point is, I would agree that Cloud is dangerous. And he probably shouldn't be in the party. But for some reason, he has to be in the party. Because he has to be in the party. It's probably because his hair is the blondest and the pokiest. Sid has blonde hair, but it's not pokey enough. Sid, I don't know if Sid's that sensical. He probably would have just gone home by now. <laughs> he kind of seemed more like bored, like, yeah, whatever, sure. I got nothing else better to do. <laughs> ah, Barrett's a little rash, though. It's more like Eris... Nanaki. Probably just Eris and Nanaki. Yeah, that's probably it. <laughs> Eris, Nanaki, Crazy Uncle Sid, and Crazy, Crazy Aunt Vincent. And then your klepto sister, Yuffie. Okie dokie, bye bye. Okay, so, uh, there was that scene. <laughs> That whole scene. And I am now going to quit. I'm, I'm not actually quitting. I'm just opening up. Uh, unless if it just like straight up froze. Did, did this did, did this seriously just freeze on me? Right, did you just freeze on me? Why, why is it frozen? I think I broke steam. Okay. It, it just, it's just not working right now. Oh, there it goes. Hello, friend. <clears throat> uh, I don't remember which one it is. 59, 54. Or it might be this one. There's a 5931. <laughs> hey, Dave. Um, well, I'm guessing it, it's this one because uh, Eris is gone, right? Yeah. Probably you. Okay. I'm sure you, you might be thinking, oh, why... Do I switch? Switch because I this one I had gotten all of the items that I said I was going to get. Um, we'll actually keep Barrett in the party. But uh, Tifa, I'm so sorry. Uh, some things came up, and uh, you know how it is. Yeah, get out. Um, and now Materia is just it's all a mess. Just, Get rid of everything. This is actually a. Uh, uh, oh my gosh. Ah, sorry. Does anyone else have materia? I mean, other than Eris, I'm assuming she took off all of her materia. I hope. Okay. Uh, I th uh, think I have new... You... Yeah, you have nail bat. I don't know if I really want to use this, though, because... Uh, the, the no slots is going to drive me nuts. I've been using Cloud to just level up Materia, and to have him not level up any Materia... 
I do have the double thing here. Um... I don't know. I mean, I guess... I guess it depends on what I'm doing right now. Let's put the nail bat on him for right now. Did I get a new one? I did. Oh, you're not you're not good though. Hmm. No. We'll stick with that. Definitely have a new one for you. I have like several. Ugh. Again, gun arm, <laughs> scissors, chainsaw, rocket punch. Uh, you guys. I don't actually know what a rocket punch looks like. I'm guessing it's like his gag weapon, and I kind of want to see what it looks like. Uh, okay. And I think I can get Sid's mop now but I might go fishing for nuts. I think it's a Zeo nut. I need like a couple of Zeo nuts. Uh, did I get, I know I got a ribbon. Hmm, but who's going to wear the ribbon? I don't know. I think I might save that for later. got a lot of crap on so let's just put a lot of crap on you Sid I know you love wearing crap uh, what do you have mastered can you like arrange it by what's mastered I wish like you had different boxes you could put things in boxes I like boxes like I would just like to separate what's mastered versus like what's not yeah I guess you can't That'd be nice. Oh well. Um, what do I have that's mastered? This is still not done yet. I think I'm gonna put... I just want... Uh, yeah, so... I just wanna get that mastered. With you. Like, if it's almost done, I'm just gonna put it on cloud. Sorry, I should have done this before I started, because I'll end up spending like 15 minutes on this. Yeah, restore. Still not mastered. Oh, you know what? I don't think I can afford to put that on you, because I actually need someone to heal. So never mind. Uh, I, still, I still haven't even leveled up that revive. Ugh. And Eris is already gone. Uh, these are all close. The earth. Is there anything else? <laughs> I've been lagging on that enemy skill. Ah, maybe I should just put counter attack on. Yeah, let's just put counter attack on there. Um. Why did I exit it? I'm sorry. <clears throat> oh boy. <laughs> Hold on. I could do a little better than that. Oh, Barrett. Uh, I got your guy just here. Oh, nothing? Nothing? Ah. <laughs> That's my sound of distress. Cheese and rice, son of a fidget biscuit. Okay, um... You know what? I just, I need to level up some things. I'm sorry. We're, we're not here for fun, we're here for leveling up. Because I'm not, of course I'm not going to immediately go into uh, the next area. Because that's never what I do, ever. Um...
These are just so close to leveling up. Um, cover is really close, too. I did it again. Sorry. Uh, some slant on the destruct. Wait, I don't think I meant to put on destruct. No, not destruct. Barrier. Do I want barrier or Sorry, Sid. Looks like you're gonna be heirs for a while. And we just got the Hoomit. Now, what that means, I like to make Sid my official dragon guy. So he always gets all the dragons. Makes me happy in my heart. Uh give you more HP, because you're going to have a bunch of crap on you. Uh, i give you a crap ton of luck, because again, you just have a bunch of crap on you. I can't believe this hasn't leveled up yet. I've had it on forever. Oops. Um, Morph hasn't leveled up yet, either. Did I put steel? Yeah, I put steel. Okay, well I'm gonna stop for now, because I this this is gonna take forever. <sighs> oh, Eris. Uh, I don't wanna save over the file, but okay, alright. <sighs> She's gone. Wasn't that fun? Did you guys have fun watching me uh plink 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 plink? Where am I? Oh, I think my uh oh sorry. My boat's that way, or my plane. Uh, yeah. Set here. I know you're set there, and you're definitely set there. Okay. I know I still can't get theirs for a while. Um, where are those Zeo nuts? I'm already lost. might be over here. I don't know. They're like on some random remote island, or it could be over there. Nah, I don't think it's this one. I like this arm kind of looks like Venom Snake's Kind of cool. I think he even has like a rocket punch too, actually. I never used it. I wasn't very good at it. I preferred the uh, electrocution one. It was very satisfying. Nope, it's not this one.
Oh, this was where the temple was. Um, so it's definitely not over here. I just know it was some remote island. I just want to find those the, the little goblins. I'll get a Zeo nut. And then I'll go over to the area. See if I can find Sid's mop. Like, I'll dig up all this stuff over there, and then I'm probably going to call it a stream. Because then I'll want to just, again, senselessly level up like I always do. Maybe I'll try for, uh, try for Cloud's, uh, limit break. I haven't really given it a good, good old-fashioned try yet. I was already here, wasn't I? Did I just go in a really small circle? Yes, I did. And I can't go that way. Oh boy. I'm lost. Well, good thing we have these sweet tunes to listen to, right guys? Huh? Can I go this way? This isn't going to take me anywhere, is it? It's just going to, like, lead me to a dead end. Or waterfall, which is where you get uh, Vincent's Limit Break. But that's later. Oh, no, look at that. Ooh. Um, gosh, I know... I feel like I know it when I see it. And by know it, I mean it. it looks like several other islands and I know that eventually I'll find the right one. Oh my gosh, my phone's ringing. I didn't turn my ringer off. I don't know anyone in Medford. Stop calling me. I keep getting a call for somebody named, like, Wilma or Wanda or something like that, I don't know. I mean, I haven't had this number that long, like, you know, you get a new cell phone number or whatever. And, like, some some chick named Wilda, I think. It's either Wilda or Wanda, I don't know. But you can totally tell it's, like, some, like, older person, I think. I just, I don't know any younger people named Wilda. Wil Wilda? Wilda. That's a weird name. Did I go in a circle again? I feel like it looked like one of these places. Maybe it's this one. Could be this one. Oops. Like last time they left like a whole message and I felt like really bad. I was like, should I call them back and let them know that this isn't Wilda anymore? It's like, oh, me and Jeffrey are gonna come up and visit you and... And Beth, Bethany, or Gertrude, or something. I was like, oh my goodness. You have the wrong number. Coming up from Arizona, or Florida, or something like that. Maybe I should actually look up where this island is instead of constantly fishing for it. All right, fine. I will look up where the little tiny island is. <sighs> oh, it's way over there. Hmm. I don't know if I can... I don't think I can get there. Yeah, I think I might actually have to have the, uh... High wind to get there. Because it's, it's that little tiny island way out there in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I can get there. I don't... I also don't know how I got this view. 
Oh, there we go. Like, I know I've been playing this game for, I don't know, 60 hours, 70, 60. But, uh, controller is still kind of funky. 60, 60 hours. Anyway, I'm going to go in here and do all the diggy stuff, though. But I'm probably not going to go to the whole next area. Or maybe I will, because there's a lot of good level uppy places in there. I don't know. So I'm starting to get all excited, like, ooh, leveling up. Oh. Um, okay. Start digging. I'm so bad at this. I could probably look this up too, but I really don't want to. Uh, which one? Uh, uh, which one is switch? It's a switch. I don't know how many you can get, but I'm gonna get as many as you can. Cause I wanna find that gosh darn mop. Like I don't have like millions of gill, but I got a pretty decent amount. And generally I don't care about achievements, but I think there is some stupid achievement uh, on Steam or whatever to get like 99,999 gil or something like that. And I was like, I want to get that for no reason. Uh, hold on. Uh, seeing roughly, okay, everyone's kind of Kind of looking exactly right here-ish. Right, right here. Okay, hopefully there's something. Bunt line. What the hell's a bunt line? Is that an item or a, a doohickey? An item or a doohickey. There you go. Oh, that's up. Oh, that, that, that. Where is it? Uh, bunt, 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 bunt. Where's the bunt? Oh. Oh, it's a gun. Okay. Sorry, I don't know weapons. Is there actually a weapon called a bunt line? It sounds delicious. Uh, okay. Cool. The only thing is, I don't remember if uh, SIDS was considered good treasure or normal treasure. You know, since it's like a mop. But, uh, I don't know. We'll try again, though. I feel like it was on the second story. That's the only thing I think. It's the only thing I think I know. Um, for what's that? For, for what? For what's that? For what's that's worth? Oh man, that's what a college education gets you, dude. I, I wish they would let you hire people while you're waiting for them to climb the ladder but they don't uh, let's get over here take your time bruh I got nowhere to be
that didn't help me at all. Uh, well, I'm pretty sure it's down. <laughs> Maybe? I think it's downstairs? I don't know, it's like... It could either be right here or downstairs. Cause this guy looks like he's looking like right here. Let's go with right here. I don't know. That one's a little, yeah. Eh, neither. Okay, let's look for normal treasure. Maybe could maybe it's normal treasure. I mean, again, it's a freaking mob. Let's do a couple down here. One here. And then one here. There we go. There we go. Oh, that should be pretty good. I can't tell where you're looking. I guess here? Right here? I guess. I can't really tell. They need to find a better better method. Ah, poop nuggets. Let's try good treasure again. Not crazy, right? The moth is in here. Ah, that's just a potion. It's not a good treasure. I've been deceived. Alright, I'm officially looking it up. <laughs> I don't think I'm wrong.
that didn't help me at all. <laughs> uh, why is the neighbor upstairs stopping, dude? There are just days where she just like stomps. Like, can you freaking hear that? It's really, really loud. Not to mention, she's awake. I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but generally she doesn't wake up till like, I don't know, 7.30. Oh, where'd I go? Let's just try out the bottom floor. All I did read, like, that made sense on that walkthrough was that it was on the bottom. Everything else, I could not quite decipher. But it was also a guide from like, I don't know, 1997, eight? Uh, what? Does that mean it's here? Are you guys pointing here? <laughs> or here? Maybe here. I think they're pointing. Oh my god. Oh my god. It almost kind of looks like there's like a little X right here. I don't know if that's intentional or not. Like, I wonder if you have to dig where they point. Could you just, like, dig anywhere? Like, could I could I pick one person and dig? Could I dig with one person? Because now I'm, I'm, st I'm starting to become very guardy with my money. Oh, I guess I could. I should have pressed done. Okay, I'm going to dig with two people. They're all pointing up there? No. I'm gonna dig at this little X. They won't let me dig at the little X. I wanna dig right here. Look at this little X right here, dude. Can I dig over here? Can I dig over here? That's really weird. So does that mean like they won't let you dig? Unless if it is the right place? Because I thought you could dig in the wrong place. I guess that's kind of reassuring. Because I, I legit legitimately thought you would be digging in the wrong place. So I guess you have to dig in the right place. Ugh. I guess at least to get a freaking potion. Maybe you have to find the, the harp first. No, that's not. That shouldn't be the case. Because we got Vincent's weapon. But alright, let's get the harp. And then we will try to get everything else. I think the harp is on the top floor. I'm not done with that mop. I'll be back for it. I don't really remember where the harp is, but I it's, I guess it doesn't matter, because even if you know where it is, they won't let you dig wherever you want. In that case, I'll just go with three, since I could just, they'll, they'll tell me exactly where it is. I guess I could have just gone with one. Again, you learn something new every time you play. Like, can it... No. Like, I'm literally just pressing the button and walking around. Because I, I legitimately can't tell where, they're, <laughs> where their eyes are pointing. Dude. I, I feel like it would be right here. Isn't this where you're pointing? Uh, yeah, 
Christmas evening. Okay, hold on. Now I want to try again. <laughs> okay, hold on. Fuck that. I'll, co I'll come back to that. I mean, screw that. Pardon my French. I've just spent like 25 minutes and probably $3,000 here. Alright. Now, let's see. Oh, you don't even have to get anybody. Okay, I'm just gonna start digging. I want to dig this little tiny X. Yeah, okay. Yeah. This, this looks like something here. I don't even have to spend any money. Dig at that little X spot, sir. I wonder if you just get a potion by default. I just could just dig anywhere. I just wasn't pressing enter. Uh on the stupid screen. Put you right here. I'm gonna put you. I'm gonna wedge you right here. Okay, we're done. I'm gonna get that freaking mop, dude. Mega elixir, that's pretty good. How much money do I have left? I'm still fine. Thrilling fun, guys. I know you guys think it's totally fun. That totally looks like an X mark. I'm just saying. It's kind of a hot mess. Uh. leave until I get that mop. Well, that and I guess that. Ah, darn it. The harp. I guess. I know I need the harp, but I want that mop. You are like, probably not gonna use it. <laughs> All it said was it was on the bottom. But apparently so are billions and billions of potions. Oh, come on, guys. That doesn't help me at all. <laughs> uh, well, I guess they're all kind of looking... Dude, I'm stuck. Ah, <laughs> uh, this isn't going well at all. Uh, okay, well... 
All I know is that they're pointing this way, so let's dig here, I guess. <laughs> oh, fantastic. Now we're not even getting potions. Maybe I... Maybe I've dug up all the potions. Ugh. Maybe it's not at the bottom. Maybe it randomizes. I don't know. Or maybe, like, each time you do it, maybe it changes? Because... I was down there, there was something down there, and... I put some body over here, like, that'd be really helpful. But I did it down there, and then I did it down there again, and then they point me in a different direction. I don't think these guys even know. This is starting to seem like a scam. Because if I put them all over here, and then they all just point to the left, that doesn't do anything for me. At all. You know? But if, you know, put some body over here, and then somebody, like, right here. That also doesn't do anything for me. Also, I am very hungry. Oh, come on, you guys. See, now that I put everybody on top, they're all pointing down towards the bottom. I'm starting to call shenanigans on you, on you, and especially on you three. <sighs> I mean, I don't... Maybe like right here? I feel like I've been right here before. Oh my goodness. You know what? You guys are full of it. <laughs> hey, let, let's try for the harp again. Let's try for the harp. They're certainly making a lot off of me, I'm telling you. Like, maybe if I would have mentioned somewhere in there, this harp is crucial to saving the world. You'll have nothing to excavate if we do not have this harp. Like, maybe, you know, they'll go, oh, man, we gotta find this harp ASAP or else, you know, dude, we're all gonna die. Then maybe, you know, they'd say, you know, they, they wouldn't really care so much about the money because then the money would uh, be a moot point. But, um, I guess, uh, Cloud didn't, didn't want to mention that. Or maybe he didn't want to start any panic or something like that. I guess that would kind of create a little bit of a panic. Or, uh, like most people, they would go, yeah, sure, man, whatever. Because, um, I don't know about you guys, but anytime I walk downtown, everybody's telling me that the world's going to end. And uh, I've kind of gotten to the point where I'm like, yeah, it is. It's not that I don't care, it's just kind of like, yeah, it is. And then I go home and then I play Final Fantasy VII. So, uh, yeah, what are you gonna do? Uh, maybe here? Looks like it might be here. <laughs> that was not where, it was behind you. You need to turn around, because that's where I placed you, sir. I mean, that's exactly where I told you to dig. Thank you, but that is still not my- Where is my mop? <laughs> I'm gonna look one more time. I feel ashamed that I don't know where this freaking mop is. I've been looking for 25 minutes.
silence overcame the chat room as Francis looked for the mop online because he was tired of wasting his money on all of these excavation dudes. I bet I have a lot of potions, though. Like a crap ton. I, I cannot find anything, anything useful, which is distressing me. I mean, or rather, I'm doing exactly what all of these are saying, you know. Just put them down and they'll dig. I'm glad you like the music. It is good music. As I say over and over and over again. But still. I mean, I, I, it's good treasure, apparently. But I just I I'm putting the dudes down. I'm 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 digging. Put the dude there. Put the dude here. I put the dudes all over the places, and the dudes don't. Or I guess it's not the dude's fault. It's my fault, because I I'm, I don't know. I'm just bad at eyeballing them. I put the dudes everywheres, and I'm very hungry. Let's throw one on this little dark spot. There. Like, how much have I wasted here? Like, I don't know. $200,000? And for what? Like, seven potions and a gun? There. They're all pointing up here. You guys are pointing like right here. But I've already like been here like three times have I dug in this spot. And I did see that someone dug actually where I thought, which is like this weird X mark spot. It's just I dug too high, they were digging down here. So I wonder if. They have to point for it in order for it to spawn there. I'm gonna try. So it was like right, right here. Oh, thank goodness. No more money are you taking from me, sir. Jerks. Uh. Sorry, Barrett. Sorry, Sid. I'm sure you guys had a lot of fun in there. You guys are all thieves. All of you.
No, I think we're blind. <laughs> Go, Sid! <laughs> Which I know that I could equip the mop, but I'm not going to yet, because i just assuming that all of the gag weapons or whatever just don't have slots. Which suuuuck. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm gonna have to level up here. But I will push forward, because I think I could just kind of get to like cutscene stuff since I'm already here. And then just backtrack. I think. I don't know. If it's too far, then I'm not. Because I'm already getting grumpy because I'm hungry. song. I know I keep saying that. I think there's like save areas. Some over here. I don't know. Everything's kind of fuzzy. Ah, there we go. Look at that. Look at that save. What are these again? There's a box up there. Sweet. I'm gonna look around this area first, because I don't quite remember. I know that once we go down, then uh, it's gonna be a pretty big cutscene. I promise I will not do that, because um, I don't want to do that yet. So pretty. I can't do anything with it yet. I'm lost. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that either. It's probably like the best scene or like the prettiest scene in Advent Children. This is so weird. Like, what am I looking at? I mean, I know what I'm looking at, but like, why? 
Why, why big fish? Why a clownfish? Is it real? Is any of this real? Is this for real? I don't know, it's just so pretty. Too bad when I'm here, all I think about is a uh, horrible death. Sorry. Beds up here. I don't want to like go too far because I don't know if I can go back. Because I know at some point. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to do that twice. Uh, something happens somewhere, or something. Then you go to sleep and you wake up and then you like have to go forward, or I like think you have to go forward, and I don't want to have to go forward already because I I'm sorry. I want to level up. I. I have to. I just have to. You don't understand. I just have to. I must. Is it in here? I don't even want to go in there. It, they might They might try to go to sleep. You can't. You cannot. You must not. Where did this go? Okay, yeah. No. No, not leaving. And this is just the other side. But, uh... You can't do anything over here. Fantastic. Okay. In here. Okay, there's the box in here. I just knew it was someplace you could go and sleep. I'm so glad I didn't take that extra step before. Just a couple of man to man getting some rest together. Yeah. 
else is here? Uh, I saw you hiding over there. I don't need you, but I saw you. So I think what I'm just going to do is, yeah, do the scene and, because I saved, and just go back from where I last saved and then go level up and then actually go back and just do it all again. <laughs> Rather than doing it in reverse, what I normally do is uh, do the scene scene off camera and then go go bed you, you know what I'm trying to say leave me alone oh it's Kingdom Hearts because as you guys all know Kingdom uh, Kingdom Hearts came before Final Fantasy and they based Final Fantasy off of uh, this game called Kingdom Hearts oops That's a joke. Um, I actually don't want to save. I don't. I, I'm getting my saves all mixed up now. How do, where am I going? Help me out here. I can't. <laughs> there we go. Um, No. Oh, God. Cloud. Come on. There we go. <laughs> Sorry.
Yeah, I know, dude. It's really pissing me off that Sephiroth has this stupid O face. It's killing it a little bit. I still think about the first time that this happened, and like, you're, you're still just kind of like, whoa, what, what just happened? And then, and then you have to like fight, and you're not really prepared to fight, and you're just kind of like, wait, <laughs> I'm not ready to fight, and you're just like, confused and kind of dumbfounded. Yeah. Yeah. Not cool. Let's face it, guys. That's the real reason I don't have my camera on. So you all don't look at me cry. That did not work. Oh boy. Oh, there goes Cloud. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> I may not even survive this. I mean, in some ways, it's kind of like... Well, it is unexpected and kind of amazing because, you know, you're, you're like, oh, oh, shoot, did I, I just healed it. <laughs> uh, it's, <laughs> it's amazing. Oh, great, it has reflect on. <laughs> that worked out. Um, it's kind of amazing because you're just, you're just kind of like, oh, my God, Ares, no, and, but then at the same time, yeah, you know, it's just, I don't know, I, I don't really know of too many things at the time that did that. Because usually it's like character death and you're like, now I must sit and stew and plot my absolute vengeance and rage. But instead you're kind of like, you're preparing to cry and be sad and all this stuff and hear some stupid, <laughs> stupid speech from Sephiroth. And instead it's like, gotta go, bye! <laughs> and then he just drops this thing on you and you're like <laughs> yeah and then the music is still playing and you don't you you're like you got those angry tears in your face or at least i did i had angry tears and i'm like i'm gonna, I'm gonna kill this stupid thing and you, uh, yeah. and you know you're like screwing stuff up and i don't know i had the angry tears i have a little bit of the angry tear right now but uh just saying. I've already mastered materia. It's saying I, I've i uh, locked an achievement, but I've mastered like several materias by this point. Good thing you don't have Tifa, she'd probably be like, oh, thank God. <laughs> no more competition, am I right? God. Sorry, I just, I don't like Tifa. <laughs> I feel like I've made that very clear. Over the last 16 episodes. But just in case I didn't. Oh, you got through disc one, you get an achievement. Go me. You, you, you're playing the game, you got an achievement. That's so frickin' depressing.
Are those balloons? I can't I can't tell what you're showing me. That's what I was going to say, but yeah, <laughs> I was going to say, or are those Tifa? Yes, boxing gloves, of course. Forgive me. Save it on your computer? Nah. <laughs> okay, and there you go. I am done. Potentially didn't save because I didn't want to move forward yet. But... I am stretching because I am hungry. Very hungry. Um, There you guys go. I'm happy that I did that because <laughs> if I didn't I knew I would have ended up moving forward and then I just have to move backwards like I keep doing um, so we've lost our beautiful heiress and her beautiful limit break that I will very 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 much miss because it is amazing very overpowered but like I said if you go through all that effort and grinding to get it uh, you freaking deserve that thing, dude. Because it's not easy to get. Uh, you have to have incredible patience <laughs> to get it. Another thing that freaking sucks, I really... It's like just such a dick thing to do, but I understand why they did it. Uh, that you get another weapon for Eris in Temple of the Ancients. You know, it's like, oh, here's another weapon, you know. Just level up her weapons, because, you know, you're going to be using her, you know, for the rest of the game. You know. You know. Yeah. Eh. I really do love Eris. I think, uh, like, over the years, I started to love her more and more and more and more. Especially once I figured out, like, actually started using her correctly. Instead of just, like, ah, she's a healer. I don't like using healers. I prefer to use people who just hit things, like Cloud. And Sid. And Nanaki. And Barrett. I would say Tifa, but, uh, I don't like her. Um, but, you know, be, be good to your healers, uh, and they'll be good to you. It just, they take a little more time, and yeah, their, their attacks suck, uh, but they're there, they're there to protect you. They're, they're there to heal you, and if you take time with them, uh, they can be the most badass people in your parties, and you won't know that until you lose them. And, uh, I'm telling you, it's, I was hoping to get more of my healing materia, uh, higher up, especially like the revive and things like that, because I'm gonna miss that. Like, I, I know I didn't show it much on stream because I was using her a lot off stream, but when I was doing a lot of grinding, it was so great having her because I didn't have to go back and forward to get, uh, you know, things and phoenix downs and stuff. Because when you're doing a lot of heavy grinding out in the field, if you have her, do fall fallen party member. Whoop, she just raised him from the dead and completely heal you. No problem. There you, there you go, guys. You're, you're all good. I'm like, oh, thanks, Harris. You're great. You know, no one else can freaking do that. Uh, but uh, thank you guys so much for coming out. I always appreciate it. Thank you, Dave. Um, and I'm going to uh, shut this off. 
Um, <laughs> yeah, exactly. The more you know. And start back from before the whole cutscene and then do it all again and watch her die again. Only, uh, I'll probably spend more time and it'll be less clumsy fighting um, Genova because I'll probably be like level 60 or something like that and actually see its moves and make sure I didn't miss anything or could steal anything and all that boring stuff that you guys don't want to see. So you have a wonderful day, wonderful evening, wonderful night. Uh, once again, I'm Francis, Kyle Gaming. Have a great night. Love you all. Bye.